We're here with Mary Schultz. How you doing? Mary, it's been a long time. How you been? Good. I've been good. It's good to see you again. I'm trying, I'm trying to use a mic stand right now. You like that? How, how it's a bit awkward. It's a, little... Yeah, it's a little awkward. But you guys get to use a mic stand, and I don't, and it's not fair. I have to use my hands. Whatever. Here I go. I'm off the mic stand. Unplugged. Not literally, because if I unplugged the mic, this would be very boring. <laughs> what was it like performing at Indie Thursday a second time? This is a fantastic audience tonight, actually. It's pretty good. There's lots of people out there. Everyone's very responsive. It's a great night. Our definition of lots is slightly different. You think it's six people, you think it's two. Two or six. Certainly more than No, two. it's definitely more than six. Seven. It's seven. It's seven. So you're you already uh, enjoying a, a tasty beverage? I am. Uh, H2O, nothing like it. Oh, that's boring. Take two. Is that vodka? <laughs> you like to get a little lit up before you, you do your music? Oh my god, that'd be horrible. No, I do. Really? Yeah. It would be horrible? It would be horrible. I never drink before I play. After I play, that's something else. But. I used to drink a lot as I played. and yeah. There are a lot of artists, lot of artists that too. It's not my thing. I wasn't an artist. <laughs> I was just playing drunk. That's what I was. No art involved. I mean, you are officially, that's official America. And by America, I mean seven people. That's my viewership. We got another guy. You're the first person to ever be back twice. That says something about you. Oh, thank you. I'm excited to How was it different than the first time? Um... Say something nice about it, other than, you know, there used to be a lot more people. No, I was going to say, actually, that I think there were, actually, the people were more attentive this time. Mm -hmm. It was a very rowdy crowd last time. Rowdy's fun, but not for me, because I play real, you know, like, thoughtful. And I remember you came, you were here last time, what month? February. And we had, anniversary. Right. We had hired homeless people <laughs> to fill in, because we, we, didn't, we couldn't use CGI, because we didn't have the money. So we paid vagrants on the streets well, to come in. Now, correct me if I'm wrong, you used to live in... Uh, Philadelphia. Philadelphia. <laughs> Philadelphia. I knew it. I, I don't forget these things. Like a steel snap up there. I was a tour guide at Christ Church Burial Ground where Ben Franklin is buried and other, four other signers of the Declaration of Independence. Okay. Now you've opened up a whole other can of worms. And I wasn't even hungry for worms. <laughs> so, you had to spiel people on what's the most interesting factoid that's this is like three or four fun facts for this interview my god we're chock full of fun facts that's what i promised and that's what i deliver what is the most interesting thing about that burial ground um oh that's a great question that's because i'm a great interviewer and you know it's a great question because you have no answer that is when you know you've really struck pay dirt in, in interviewing. See, what I'm doing right now is stalling so that you can think of the answer and we don't have any dead air. All right, good. So the most interesting thing, uh, sadly I couldn't remember his name at first. This is why. So Benjamin Rush is buried there. He signed the declaration. He also um, was a doctor during yellow fever. And everybody left the city during yellow fever because it was horrible and everybody's catching it and dying. Doesn't sound fun. No, not fun. But he stuck around to treat the, the sick. Fun fact. That was a fact. <laughs> Ice cream's fun. That was a fact. So two fun facts. Mm. I take. I, I thought it was gonna be three, but or whatever I said before. Take one away. I'm sorry. That was the most. Tour guide on that one. Thank God you're good at music, right? <laughs> wow. Yellow fever, and he stuck around, and now he's dead. Enjoy, children. It's okay, they don't watch it anyway. Whether oh, oh, here we go. There are. I don't know, but supposedly. You have to have stories like you saw a ghost. Did you see a ghost? No. Liar. That's what the ghost wants you to say. It made you pro oh, There was a covenant with a ghost, and it said you couldn't speak about it, or you'd lose your talent, and that's why you're a singer, because a ghost gave it to you. Well, I really couldn't tell you. If Infirm or deny? I can't. I can't. That is the fact. That is a fact. I'll shoot you. Most people who spend this much time with me feel that way.